In this video, I'll show you how to fix the message your device isn't part of the Netflix household for this account. So there's basically three different ways that we can solve this. Now I'll be showing you this on a laptop, but if you are on a mobile phone or a television, then the steps are going to be exactly the same. So the first thing you need to do is just make sure you're disconnected from any VPNs. So on my computer, I can just head over to settings and click on this here, come over to network and internet from the left hand side, come down to VPN, and then just make sure you're disconnected from any of your VPNs. As you can see here for mine, it says not connected. So we can click close out of this. So if that doesn't fix the issue, what you'll need to do is just close down the Netflix application, whether it be on your television or your phone or your laptop, just make sure Netflix is fully closed down. And then we're going to head over to our Wi-Fi and you're just going to turn off your Wi-Fi. So if you're on a phone, you can just put this in airplane mode, or if you're on your television, you can just temporarily disconnect from the Wi-Fi. So with your internet turned off, we're then going to relaunch the Netflix application. And as you can see here, we now have the application running with Without any error messages it just says you're not connected to the internet and all we simply need to do is head back over to our wi-fi connection and turn our wi-fi back on and now this is going to reconnect us to the Netflix application and we're going to be able to use the app without any further error messages. So like I said, this should work on all of your devices, whether it be a phone, television or your laptop. If you have tried all of these steps and you still are getting some kind of error message, the last thing that I'd recommend doing is just heading over to Netflix in an internet browser, coming over to your profile in the top right hand side, clicking on account, select devices from the left hand side, click on access and devices. And as you can see, here are all the current places that were signed in. So what I would recommend doing is just signing yourself out of a couple of these devices. And then once again, you can check to see if that now fixes the issue. And that's it guys. If you did find this video helpful, then please consider dropping a like and subscribing.